How's it, Sean, from Combat Simulations? Better form. This is the scenario we're going to be playing today from Command Ops 2. Uh, from the Axis side, we're going to be playing it from the Talon's point of view. All right, so before we get started, please subscribe to my channel. It's free. And also leave comments and suggestions and watch my videos and like my videos and share them. It helps me a lot, I promise you. If you're into these types of games, my channel's the place to subscribe to, yeah. All right, so... Scenario settings. Initial orders delay will gravitate from 0 to 100% during the first hour. Access briefing. General Giuseppe Tellera. You are hereby tasked with the successful draw withdrawal of the 10th Army from Senator. I can't pronounce that. In doing so, you are to make every effort to secure the safe passage of the Red Rigo Regio. Uh, I can't pronounce it. Remaining, remaining artillery and other support assets. It's absolutely vital that they survive the journey so that they can form the nucleus of a rebuilt and victorious Italian army in Libya. All right, scenario briefing. North Africa, the 5th February, the 5th, 1941, south of Benghazi, Libya. It's a historical scenario. In late January 1941, the British learned that the Italians, in response to the British success of Operation Compass, were evacuating Serena, I can't pronounce that, by the way of the coast. Uh, road from Benghazi. The British 7th Armoured Division was dispatched to intercept the Italian army. En route to their destination, it was evident that the entire division together was too slow, so a flying column was sent on a direct route across the desert towards the coastal road near the settlement of Beda Form. On the 5th of February 1941, they arrived at the town and proceeded to form a roadblock along the road to cut off the retreating remnants of the Italian 10th Army. The following day, the Italians arrived and attacked, but failed to break through the, bro the blockade. For two days, 500 riflemen, a squadron of light tanks and a few field and anti-tank guns held off 20,000 Italian soldiers with 100 tanks and 200, uh, 200 guns. The, flying, uh, the fighting was close and often hand-to-hand. -hand. At one point, uh, a regimental sergeant major captured an Italian tank by hitting the commander over the head with a rifle butt. The final effort came on the 7th of February when 20 Italian Fiat M13s and 40 broke through the thin cauldron of riflemen and anti-tank guns only to be stopped by field guns barely yards from the regimental HQ. The officer commanding the Italian forces was General, General Tellera. He was killed by a bullet on the field and Lieutenant General Ferdinando Conna assumed command only to be captured during the battle by the Allied forces. Alright, good. So... This is, a, if you watch my previous video, uh, I played as allies. We had objectives over there on the, both these sides of the, of the line. And once again, as I said in that badly designed scenario, because there's no objectives that are common. We've only got, let me give you an idea, we've only got the exit objective. We don't have objectives there to fight over those. So it's not a common objective. So he's got no reason to stop us here. He's just only got the reason to, 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 to guard those objectives. And we've got to destroy the enemy. That's it. That's it. So I'm, I've moved everybody down here. Um, yeah, I, in fact, I'm going to take them off this max. Yeah, just so that they... And they're going to exit out of there. And they're going to attack along the way just to clear the route. And that's it. We've got reinforcements coming throughout the day. Uh, or, hey, every 10 minutes we've got... Well, we've got a lot of reinforcements coming all the way down to down to the um, the second day at right, 3 o'clock in the afternoon. All right, so they're all coming thick and fast. So, yeah, so basically I'm just going to reattach them all um, to these groups as they come and then they're all exit at the same time and they're going to just be reattached. That's it. These guys are going to go down to the column and try and get off at the moment. That's it, yeah. So let's just see, because I mean, obviously there's no common objective, so I'm, my goal, obviously, is to get all these guys off the field, to fill that up, that's the first goal. Once that's filled up, then I'll work on uh, trying to kill these units. I know he's got objectives over here, because I've got hindsight as a perfect science. So I'm going to, I'm just going to re just reattach him. I'm then going to, whatever's left, if we fill that up, then we'll, we'll try and make a bit of a fight here on the sides here. But as it stands, that's uh, somebody else has arrived. Okay, so let's just gonna keep an eye because these, these these guys are coming thick and fast. So he's arrived. 
I'm going to reattach him, and he's he's reattached. Okay, good. So let them all just reattach there so that they all can get out. In fact, um, maybe I should. No, I'll just keep them reattached. Let them go so they follow each other out. It's actually better sometimes to to give these guys individual. Let's reattach them. Um, just want to see. Uh, where's my messages? Okay, he's arrived, he's arrived, he's arrived. Okay, good. So all of these guys are reattached. So they're just reattached to this guy. The main guy hasn't come yet, so that's good. Uh, somebody else has arrived. Uh, shucks, who is it? Yeah, so I'm getting these guys. No, I've sent all these guys. Okay, so they're all being sent. Oh, you know what he doesn't have? He doesn't have. Let him exit. Let him exit, yeah, by himself as well. Uh, he can attack along the way and he can go on. Yeah, let him do his own exit. I don't want them to be... And then these guys are all attached, I think. And let them all exit. Yeah. Uh. I'm just putting a bypass in there so that they they don't get all tired up here. Uh, let him reattach. Yeah, let him go. Okay, let's just put them as bypass as well. Just for now. Uh, let's see it left. Okay, so we got some guys off. Where is it? Ah, uh, yeah, so we got quite a few actually. Oh, somebody else has arrived. Okay, good. Let's reattach him. I'm going to take him off sleepies. Uh, off sleepies. And I'm also going to take him off sleepies. So that they can get out at night time. Just to get them moving so that they so we can get that thing filled up now. Okay, who else has arrived? You've arrived. Okay, let's reattach him. Still the 10th army hasn't arrived yet. Uh, Alright, so they've all exited. Oh, we've still got quite a bit to go. I just don't want to uh, let them go for a bit and then I'll put them on sleepies. Oh, no sleepies. Let's see if we can just bypass these guys. Hmm. 
Uh, okay, so you can uh, also exit out here. And you can uh, quick ghost and you can do the bits and pieces. And you can exit out here. These guys, I'm going to take off their... I'm going to put them on their sleepies. Because the last thing I need is for them to not be able to get off the field. And the same with him. Sleep is normal. Alright, good. And who's arrived here? Let's reattach him as well. And then he's going off. Yeah, he needs to have his sleepies. Yeah, I don't want them to to bypass over here. Start taking bypass routes here. Yeah, then we just go down the line. Yo, yeah, that's it. You're just waiting for them to wake up and then go. Yeah, it's picking up. Picking up nicely. We've still got some reinforcements to come, eh? Sheesh, look at this. 20 units, man. 40! Can you believe it? This is not coming here. 40 units, bro. Goodness. Come on. Gosh, man. Reattach these mothers. Are you still getting out? Okay, yeah. Alright, reattach him. Jeez. Look at that. I'm just putting them all on. For now. So that they can all just exit so that we get our exit points. Anybody else arrived? Shit. Come on, get off the field. I need these guys to get off the field, yeah. Just look at the size of these guys. Yeah, because the house has is arrived, let's reattach them, so I can just get off the field, oh, this is, this. one, 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 can, can you believe it, this one, this one is 40 units, bro, jeez, look at the size of that. Now we still need a lot more to exit out of there. Tanks, everything. Okay, so it's going. Who else has arrived? Hang on. Let me look. Uh, 
Yeah, reattach. <laughs> oh, that's, where's my orders thing here? Uh, orders. Okay, go. <sighs> Come on, nose. Head out the field. Who else has arrived? Reattach. Okay, good. Let's look at our objectives. We're getting there, slowly. Okay, we've got enough. Okay, so we have enough infantry. So we can, we can... We can do that number. We might as well with these eyes because we've got enough infantry and he can be a max and he can attack and he can do it. He can do that, but he doesn't need to exit out because we've got enough infantry going and we just... I'm just thinking of these guys here. Uh, I think I'm going to change you to do that. Yeah. And uh, not exit, because you're ba basically mainly infantry. Right? And then you fall underneath this guy, you can reattach over there. So let's just see if we can just get, because we've got enough. We've got enough. Uh, we got enough infantry. We need armor and that sort of thing to get off. Ooh, who's arrived now? Message, you've arrived. Reattach. Okay, good. We've got till tonight. Yeah. There's somebody here that's going to be a 40. Let me tell you, that's going to be a 40. Reattach. Shit. I'm just sending them down there. And you you might as well fight your way down there, eh? I mean, I know I haven't... Let's, 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 let's get you fighting down there so that you go. Otherwise... Let's see if we can deny him something over here. How much bombard do we have off? We've got some bombard. We need lots more bombard and artillery. And you... Okay, yeah, you don't need to go off. You're infantry. So we need to try and deny him some of these. Because I know he's got... Jeez. Okay, so where do you come from? Okay, reattach. <laughs> okay, and then, jeez, now we're talking. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. Look at the size of these mothers. Okay, I, this is a, this is the 40, right? Okay, they're all taken care of. That must be the 40. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Look at the size of this mother. Hey, eh? Look at this. Look at the size of these boys here. 40 units, bro. Shit. Let me just get back here. Where's the other one now? Somebody else has arrived. Let's reattach him. Let's just send them all that way out. Let's see, and then we'll just fill that up. Where's the... I just want to look at those messages again. Okay, so he's been reattached and he's been reattached. Okay, good. Somebody else has arrived. Did I miss something? No, nobody else has arrived. Okay, so do we have any more reinforcements? We've got we still got a ten unit to come.
Okay, so this last reinforcement has come. Okay, let's reattach him. Then we're done. Uh, yeah, we're getting there slowly. We need to get more tanks off the field. Tanks and artillery. That's really where our problem is. Just thinking over here. Oh, he's still going. Okay, that's my main. Oh, he's still going. Well, okay, so hang on. This is still two days. We still got another. We got tomorrow still. I keep forgetting. It's 20, it's day three, 20 hundred hours. Are these guys going to ever come? I think he's going to, he's got too little force here man, he's nothing going on here. I'm just going to reattach him. See if he can just help getting out of here. See now he's now clumped up over here. It's only because he's put units here. He's got no objective over there. He's, he's got one here I think. If I can remember, that's where he's got that pile and he's got one down here. Yeah, by the hill, yeah, wherever. Is this so coming? Is he, is he gonna, is he gonna... Yeah, I've actually asked him to attack. I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna max him. Let him, let him, let him, let him do his bits and pieces. Let him max out there. And the same with us, so, so that he can fight with good conviction. Yeah. Just taking too long to get off the field. I suppose they gotta do all their orders and whatever. So much, so much over here. I mean, it's just flippin' scary the amount of units we've got over here. I mean, 40. Hey, when it gets night time, I'll take these guys off sleepies. I'll wait till the 90s. I'm also thinking of asking these guys to go individually off because I think what happens is um, when you when you're under this command you uh, everything is slowed up let's take him off sleepies None, just to get him, just to get him to go in the sky as well. 
just just to get them rolling. Just to get them rolling. It's a lot here to build. It's a lot. I'll keep them off sleepies till till probably uh, two o'clock tomorrow morning. And I'll put them back on sleepies. Quite a bit short of armor and uh, and bombard. Okay, so I'm going to pause this game uh, until there's further action. Yeah, all right, back, back here. Yeah. Um, yeah, still, I've sent these guys on another route down here. Maybe, maybe they can, I don't know, they can make this. Let me bring that over there. Maybe that'll make it a bit quicker. I don't know. Just to get out of here, yeah, bypass this lot here. Yeah. But this is over this, this, this like, Okay, there's paths here, which has helped, but I mean, it's still desert. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. So he's doing, a, he's doing a, a quite a good job here, because he's blocking me. Yeah, he's obviously, these are his objectives. If you watch my previous video, he's got objectives over here, but he's got quite a large force. So, luckily, he's, these objectives are pretty close, I suppose. So he's doing a good job of blocking this road here. I think I did the same thing, and I blocked him over here. Let's see if we can get around there. Yeah, this lot should overwhelm through here. It should be able to get through there quite a quite a bit because I mean, we've got a lot of we've got a shitload of troops here. I actually want them to fight their way through there. Yeah, yeah, let them fight their way through there. Max also drive these guys out. So we need those points as well from kills. I'm hoping this guy can go. Others, I gotta reattach him. Yeah, at 40 units to one one reinforcement. I mean, come on. <laughs> it's like a it's like a walking it is a walking army, that's what it is. 40 units in one reinforcement. It's all this caterpillar stuff coming down the road, yeah. I don't know if he's gonna have enough time to get around here. Yeah. Because I mean this is all sand and stuff. So, 
I don't know if he's going to have enough time to get through here. But I mean, we've sent him, so let him go. I don't think we're going to get everybody off the field, that's for sure. If we could just get these two O's, this so off, we'd be, we'd be in good shape. Because he's got a few tanks. And he's got some, okay, he's got some artillery as well. So that's what we can write if we can get him off. Yeah, he's got this whole lot blocking here. There's his objective here and there's one over here somewhere. All right, I'm going to pause this until there's further changes. Yeah, I'm back. I like this little lot. I'm hoping this little lot can sneak through the back here. Because obviously he's got this choke point going here. So us getting through there is going to be very difficult. He tried to go around there, which was a decent enough idea. And then we've got these guys that we're still fighting over here. Because they came from... I think he gets these reinforcements from here. They've like intercepted us on, there on the line. So I'm hoping that this little group can get out here. Open. This little side quest thing here. We've got to make it by 2000 tonight. Let's take the attacks out. No, it can't be this. This is possible. Yeah, let them go. Let them go down and see if we can get these guys out. Sneak, sneak, sneak my way out here. I don't want him to be too tired. Come on, uh, get out. Yeah, go, go. So I needed you to go. I need you off the field. You need to be off. Yeah, you can take everything, your infantry, your tanks, whatever, off the field, and your artillery. I need that because we short bombard, we short armor, not anti, but I'll send that whole lot off there. Come on, guys. Go. He's gonna have to fight this way, that way. Just want these guys off. Come on, come on, now.
and you can also exit because there's nothing going on here. You can also exit. Yeah, okay, brilliant. How did that look? So we got some. Yeah, you can also exit. All of these guys can just exit. There's nothing going on over there. Let this guy just exit as well. And this up on bombard artillery as well. Okay, so what are we looking at here? Uh, yeah, we got almost lots of lots of we need some bombard off the field here. Yeah. That's what we need. Come, bro. I think I'm going to put you on a on a. Yeah, no. Let's just do that. Let's see if we can bypass bypass. Just to get just to get the artillery off. This is never getting off the field. This is just lots of uh, this lots left behind. We're not getting any of this stuff off the field. That's for sure. Just want some of this artillery off. I'm hoping I can get some of these guys off. Let's just see if we can take away their sleepies. Ah, we want some bombard off, some artillery off. Yo, this is a slow process because he had a section of reinforcements that came from here somewhere. And this is where it's like intercepted me on this line over here. Can't move any faster. And yeah, we're not going to get through because he's got this objective here and here. So he's kind of holding on to this and he's stopping me on the road. Yeah, which is good plan, good strategy. That's why I went with his back group here. I wish these guys would move, man. Yeah, quickest, fastest, go. Let's see if I can get one, some of these bombards off here. Quickest, fastest, go. No sleep. Get these bombards off here, I'd be very happy. Take them off the sleep. No, that's not going to do. That's not going to do it. Okay. Uh, no. Unspecified. Avoidance. Alright, avoidance. And bypass. And unspecified. Avoidance. Get these guys off here. Uh, bypass, avoidance, fastest. Let's see if we can get this artillery off. Yes, that's better. You go around that side. It's too late now, 20 hundred hours. Just trying to get this artillery off. But it's just too late. Yeah. Too late, too, too, too little, too much, whatever, too late. So 2000 hours the game ends, scenario ends. So we're not going to get nothing going on over there. It looks drawish in nature, but I don't know. And then we can go down that way. Ach, you know what? Reattach the so. Uh, maybe he'll get off the field. Let's see if he can get off. Go on, go, 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 go. You can do it. Go for gold. Go for gold. We need you off the field. Ah, brilliant. 
So we did get some artillery. We need another one. Go, go for gold, go for gold, go for gold. How much, how much do we have? Ah, uh, 14 of 66. Yeah, it's almost done now. It's an hour to go. He's still trying to get off, and he's still going. Okay, good. I'm hoping he can get off. Okay, well, it's finished now. We're not going to make it with that uh, artillery guy. I don't know. A draw or a loss here. I'm not sure. We've got a lot over here. We couldn't get through here, so I sent this guy on the sides here. Yeah. Oh, I don't know. I don't know if that's a good idea, bro. Go on, go, go. You can do it. Go for gold. Go, 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 go. Come on, come on, come on. Quick. Oh, he did exit. Brilliant. Brilliant. Okay, let's just see what that looks like. What do we look like now? Uh, yeah. Okay, so we got... We did get everybody off, but... We got most. We got some of that artillery off, which is important. All right, let's just see what the result brings us. Yeah, it's a draw. I thought it'd be a draw. Yeah, fair enough. The uh, battle ended in a stalemate. I'm relieved that the enemy was finally checked, but I must warn you that some at HQ are beginning to doubt whether you are the right man for the job. Remember, neither you nor I can afford another result such as this. Yeah, R Rodolfo Graciano. Graciani, <laughs> I can't pronounce his name. All right, so he, we lost a lot. Okay, look at the infantry loss. Well, look what he lost. We lost, well, armored fighting vehicles, he lost more. And guns, we lost a lot more. But we lost a ton of infantry. We got 64 points out of this, and he got 78. Fair enough. Uh, yeah, you know what? As I said in the first scenario, can't make uh, scenarios without common objectives somewhere otherwise there's no fight there's no there's no need there's no friction in the scenario and i've said this before uh luckily for him and for us obviously these objectives he had here on the sides here were close enough to the road he should have had one on the road like i said but they were close enough to the road so he was able to to sort of block us here and this is where we should have been this is where we should have had the objective over here to block there not just stole those two objectives but luckily these objectives were close enough so he had enough forces to block the main road that made a bit of a fight out of this but once again they take their chances these uh, scenario designers because you cannot have you shouldn't ever have a scenario without some common objectives otherwise be, there's no friction in the scenario but luckily there was enough here because basically he stopped us over here the only thing is, once we get our 60 off, right, what do we fight for? Okay, the only thing is to destroy the enemy. Fair enough. Uh, but, I mean, where's his objectives? How do we how do we know where to... But luckily, this is a constrained area, so we would obviously know where to find him. But after that, it's destroy the enemy. I mean, yeah, okay. Uh, would have been better if they had common objectives here. If he had an objective yeah. And we had these to get to clear the wings here, because that would have been a, a proper objective if he, if it, if he's got these two objectives on the sides here, like he had when I played. Uh, that would have been good enough to give us those objectives as well, because this is a bypass. These are bypass routes, so those objectives would have been handy for us too in order to bypass. I don't know why they didn't do it. Never do scenarios without common objectives, at least some that are common. If you watch that previous video, man, you see what I'm saying. And you saw this in the Pindos one as well. This just, for the Axis, happily worked out this way because these objectives are pretty close. So he's able to stop me getting out here, in a sense. But he didn't have this as an objective. That's why I was able to get around the side here. And he was letting me take this from yeah, And then on the sides, he was letting me take it because he didn't have a common objective there. He should have had an objective to stop me there. But I was able to come around here and get Oaks. And then the, initially I put Oaks in there. Anyway, that's just my opinion. 
Uh, I know I need a bitch and moan. So uh, it's all done. All right. Yeah, I love this game. Go get it. It's such a good game. Thoroughly enjoyed this. It was a great scenario. I enjoyed it as well. I, even though I'm still irritated at the fact that there's no common objectives, uh, especially the first video, you go watch that one. This one wasn't so bad. It was more of a fight. It was a little bit better. All right. Yeah. Uh, I think I've covered everything. Sean from Combat Simulations. Please subscribe to my channel. It's free. And also leave comments and suggestions. And watch my videos. And like them and share them. Helps me a lot. I promise you. If you're interested in this type of warfare. Uh, modern uh, modern from ancients to modern. Realistic combat simulations. Overviews, tutorials and tips as well. Then subscribe. And watch my videos. And leave uh, comments and suggestions. Alright. Until our next Command Ops fight. Good day on you.